This is the Tang Star Signs Big Brain Foldable. In fact, it's not just one foldable, it's actually three. This particular one is the uh, cross section of the brain where you can see the inside structures. I also have, along with this product, this foldable, which is the four lobes. And on top of that, I also have the different sections of the cerebral cortex. So Broca's area, Wernicke's area, um, the primary somatosensory cortex, all of that is on this one. So all three of these come in this product, but they're all basically assembled in the same way. So as you can see, each foldable is made from two pieces of paper, which when cut along the seam and taped together, form a nice foldable that fits neatly into a binder without overlapping the binder rings. If you want to use these foldables in an interactive notebook, all you would do is cut along the seams, these dotted lines here, in order to create a smaller foldable. Now, let's take a closer look at the features of this. First of all, each of the foldables contains a diagram in the center of the brain. It's nice and big for students to color to help aid in understanding of the different parts. And if you take a look here, I want to zoom in on this one. This particular foldable is one of several options I provide for differentiation. The one you see before you is the most comprehensive for helping to lead students through a very structured and guided lesson. Each structure connects to a numbered description box and labels are provided. This allows you to go step by step through the lesson and reference each number or label as you go along so that students can always find their place. So you can talk about structure number three, structure number four, structure number five. Now another one of the options I provide looks very similar to this, except that I don't give the labels, I provide a blank after the number. And that is for more advanced students for whom you might want to ask questions like, does anyone know the name for structure number four? Now this will allow for more participation. When it comes to filling in the descriptions, I've provided you with a full answer key. This full answer key provides a lot of explanations and descriptions for each part. Now, from this, you can pick and choose how much you actually want your students to know. And this way, you can customize notes for your own class. When it's completed, all three of these make great graphic organizers to help students review for upcoming quizzes, tests, or exams on this topic.